In this short video clip, we're going to look at some percentage problems that are not applications as of yet, and we're going to look at three of them because there are three uh, uh, values in a typical problem like this. So first I'd like to share with you uh, about some particular words in these kinds of problems and what those words represent in a mathematical sentence. The first word is the word of. And in mathematics, when we say, let's take 45% of 320, we mean to multiply. So of means to multiply. When we use the word is in mathematics, that represents uh, the symbol, I'm sorry, I meant to have here, equals. So what number is 45%? What number equals 45% of 320? And then when we use the two words together or a phrase like what number, we'd like you to replace that with a variable. Let's use the variable x. So in this particular problem, what number, so here's our question, what number x is or is equal to, is equal to 45% when you use 45% in a math problem, you have to use it as a decimal value. So I have to take the decimal place that occurs right here, and I have to move it two places to the left, and write that as 0.45. Finally, of, of 320, so we want to multiply 0.45 times 320, and we find that that's equal to 144. I'm going to change our problem. I'm going to step out of the screen. I'll be right back so I don't have to stop the camera. All right, let's do the same thing. This time, we are given, if you will, a portion. We're not taking a percentage of some number. We know that the number 14 is 32%. So again, move that decimal place two places to the left. Of. Of means to multiply. Now I'm going to put, um, I'm going to go ahead and put parentheses here. Because for the what number, I want to put in the letter X. If I had put an X to represent multiply, I would have had X and X side by side. That's very confusing. Um, so I'm going to put it like this. 32% of X. To solve for X in this particular problem, I'm going to divide both sides by 0.32. And I'll find out that X is equal to 43.75. So again, given two things out of three in this phrase, I'm looking to solve for that what number. The next one we're going to uh, do, we're going to solve for the percentage. Again, using the word is represents equal, the word of represents multiply. When we're given values, we just put them in the, the, the mathematical sentence. So 4 is. In this case, what percent? We've had here what number. Um, I'm going to use that thing I don't know. I'm going to represent it by the letter X. What percent? So that'll be X of 80. So I want to multiply by 80. And in order to solve for X, I have to divide both sides by 80. And I find out that x is, as a decimal value, it's 0 0.05. And when I want to put that percentage symbol on this number, I have to multiply by 100 or move two places to the right. And I would say that 5% um, of 80 is that value of 4.